WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Happy Friday. It's 9 a.m. Let's see what kind of market action we have going on this morning. So we had the jobs number coming out at 8.30 a.m. this morning, beating expectations, coming in at 209,000 jobs added, more than the 180,000 they expected by economists. I have gold up here right now, seeing some action on that 8.30 mark, was trading at about 12.74, spiked down below 12.67, rising back up to 1268.90 as of right now. Checking the markets, we have markets marginally higher. S&P futures up three. Let's jump over here as well. We'll jump back into the euro in a moment. Um, there's gold and there's the S&P. So same thing, some volatility this morning on that payroll number coming out at 1030 this morning, spiking higher above 2476, back down to 2474. There's our peak at gold as well, 1275 down to below 1267 and currencies currencies dollar trading higher euro trading lower right now euro us dollar trading at 11836 jobs number putting a lot of fuel in the fire as it breaks down and the market interprets what happened so 100 uh, 209000 jobs added versus the 180 and they also had uh, a revision of 231000 uh, 231000 jobs added in June versus the 222,000. So where will the markets head today? Head on over to TFNN. You can click this link, head on over to our Facebook page, guess the close. The close for the market today is gonna to be the NASDAQ Composite Index. So we'll see where that shakes out and maybe the market's flying so much, would be nice if my screen would load, but you can head on over to our Facebook page. Uh, today's prizes will be listed right there and the guess is for the NASDAQ. We will see where that shakes out and we'll see where this market shakes out. We'll see if the Euro can continue lower and gold getting action as well. Markets marginally higher. We'll see if we can close at another high, but as we come into Friday, anything is possible, that's for sure. What else do we have going on? Crude oil, let's jump to crude oil real quick as we come into this break. We're jumping into the, uh, let's back this down, back this down. Commodities, binaries, crude oil. Let's check out that daily where we have crude oil trading. Right now, $49. We're looking at the September contract. And again, volatility as we came in this morning, as low as 48.50, rising higher to 49. We'll see where that shakes out for the 2.30 close in the futures pit in oil. Thanks so much, folks. Stay tuned. Head on over to our Facebook page. Guess that close. Stay tuned. Mr. Larry Pesavento coming up right now. Great day of programming at TFNN. Have a have, great Friday. In quiet markets, investors search for new trading opportunities. We'd like to introduce you to a new product that provides opportunities even in flat markets. Nadex, the North American Derivatives Exchange, is a new and innovative Chicago-based exchange registered with the Commodity Futures Trading Commission. And unlike most other exchanges, Nadex allows you to trade directly through them with direct market access when using their trading platform. Nadex never charges a fee to use their platform, which even includes real-time charts and full custom capability. Nadex's unique short-term binary options allow traders and investors to capitalize on strategies even when the underlying markets are quiet. Nadex's innovation has allowed them to come up with a line of unique trading products that are unavailable anywhere else. See how it works at Nadex.com. That's N-A-D-E-X.com or click on the Nadex banner on the front page of TFNN.com. Futures and options trading involves risk and may not be appropriate for all investors.